All right, welcome to the 31st annual National Night Out. Therefore, Karen Hunt, Mayor of the City of Coppell, do proclaim Tuesday, October 7, 2014, as National Night Out in the City of Coppell, Dallas, Texas. Um, one of the reasons I got to know our neighbors in our neighborhood was because of National Night Out. So I am forever indebted to you guys for conducting this for years, and I am happy to move to approve item number 10, which is proclaiming October 7, National Night Out in the City of Coppell. Thank you. Second by Council Member Mahalik. All in favor? Long Mahalik Mays Road, Yingling, Franklin Hill. None opposed. Motion carries. It's National Night Out 2014, the 31st annual of National Night Out. It's a beautiful night here in Coppell, Texas, and we're ready and geared up to go to our 68 block parties here in Coppell. We have the city council, the mayor, city manager, the chief, deputy chief, and a lot of police officers. Of course, we got McGruff and the National Night Out Night. We're really excited to go meet the block captains and the citizens, eat the great food, see the kids, and pass out all the goodies we got for them. We'll, we'll see you out there, and hopefully there's some good food.
National Night Out is so important for Coppell because it's the night that we get people out of their houses and meet their neighbors. It's important for the safety of the city and also just for the overall camaraderie that um, Coppell has. We have 68 parties tonight and that means a lot of people are getting out and meeting each other, sometimes for the first time and sometimes reacquainting themselves with their neighbors. When we did our block parties in the past, it was just simply our block. The, the great thing about National Night Out, that campaign, is it gives us the ability to reach out to the whole neighborhood. And that brings us all together for one night and uh, get to know your neighbors. And uh, you familiarize yourself with everybody in the neighborhood. Uh, well, the important thing about National Night Out for us is just building a sense of community growth and getting to know each other so we all look out for each other and have each other's back for when you know, ever we ever might need it or whatnot. Um, well, we always order out some food, and um, for the event we have a bounce house every year for the little kids, and uh, that seems to suit everyone well. We get all in a big circle and a powwow and talk and have some fun. Very excited, but you know, mostly just glad that people actually came out, and they have. We've got the whole neighborhood down here, everybody's having fun. We've got a poster of the neighborhood where people can mark on their house. We've got the bouncy house for the kids. We've got Chipotle here, catering, the food is great, people are having fun. We couldn't ask for a better evening. This is a great neighborhood. This is a fun neighborhood. There's a lot of diversity in the neighborhood, diversity of ages, Agreed. a lot of children. Right. So there's just a lot of activity in this neighborhood, um, and all age levels are represented. So so it's a it's a fantastic neighborhood. Agreed. So I think every time neighbors get together, it's helpful. It's great that we know our neighbors. I know a lot of times uh, it's hard for us to get out and know our neighbors, and, and uh, maybe less so than it was 30 years ago. But events like this make it continue to happen, and it's a, it's, a, it's a matter of safety, and it's a matter of knowing who the people are that you live by, and I think that's important. I'm having a great time. Yes. This has been an event that we've been involved in as a company, and we always uh, partner with the communities that are around our store, and we love to come meet um, the citizens in our community and make sure that they know that we're involved and make sure that um, they're supported in their community national night out. You know, I really noticed that it just brings the communities together. I see the neighbors talking to each other and, you know, working together to bring um, these great events to their neighbors. Well, National Night Out is important to Coppell for a lot of reasons. The primary reason is because it allows everyone in our community to get to know one another a little bit better. And when you get to know one another a little bit better, you tend to bond more, you tend to create uh, lasting friendships, you uh, tend to create more care about your neighborhood and your block and your community. I mean, that's really what this is all about. It's all about community, and, uh, and that's why I like it so much. I really do. This is, uh, this is my ninth National Night Out, and I've enjoyed it. Uh, I've enjoyed everything that comes from these neighborhoods. The enthusiasm that, that, our, that our citizens have for this event is just almost infectious. We keep doing it because sometimes this is the only time of the year we meet our neighbors. Uh, we see them, we see them on the streets, we see them walking, but some, for some of these people, the only time we actually speak is tonight. We just met two or three new neighbors. There's new people every year. Um, there's people always moving into the neighborhood. There's people that are too scared to come last year that came this year, but um, we've probably in three years met 50 of our neighbors. When this is actually is our first stop for tonight, we've got about 15 more to go to. But uh, yeah, we always are treated very nicely. National Night Out is really important because it, it allows us to interact with the people that employ us and, and they get to meet us and, and see that we're real people too. And <laughs> No, it's just fun, especially with the kids. We love to interact with the kids. We hand out the sticker badges. Today's the National, oh my God! Today's the National Night Out, so for the entire neighborhood, we are allowed to come here and celebrate Free ice cream for under three dollars fifty cents. Come here next year. Too late today. Yeah. Too late today. We're here tonight in Capel trying to uh, be aware of family members in Capel the um, how important it is to protect their homes and their families, either fire protection or theft or whatever the situation is. Great chemistry with the neighborhoods. The families seem to get along real well with each other. Uh, the kids are loving it, obviously, uh, with the, the ice cream trucks and just the. There seems to be a com camaraderie uh, in Coppell that I, that I haven't seen in a lot of places. So, I have been doing National Night Out on our street for six years, but I think they've been doing it for at least 20 plus years in the Meadows. 
I grew up here in Capel. Um, I moved here in 1972 and I remember knowing all of my neighbors and how important that was to me as a child and knowing all my friends were my neighbors and so I wanted to start this up again so that my neighbors and all of us would get to know each other because it seems like everyone comes into the garage, into their back cave, and we don't see each other. So this is a great opportunity for us to all get together, our kids get to know each other because they're all going to school together. So that's why it's important to us. And also it prevents crime because we all know each other and can help each other out. Because I know if there was any kind of crisis that our neighbors would get together. I mean, you can see we have so many people here. It's such a great neighborhood for us and for our children. So we're so glad to be here. It's actually good for the community to come together. It gets time for us to meet, kind of mingle, and then also talk about what's going on in the community. We send out emails if there's things that are going on, and then we also have uh, Facebook, which we link up to the police department. So if there's anything going on, we send it out to our community too. Oh, it's great. We really love Capel, and it's just it's nice to be able to meet neighbors that you haven't met before. You know, you might see each other in passing driving down the street, but it's really good to, to meet neighbors uh, that, that you don't know yet. And uh, we just love the, the community feel of Capel. You know, it's just a real safe area. Um, I just thought it'd be really nice. Uh, a lot of new people have moved to our neighborhood, including us, and we didn't know that many people, and we thought, well, let's go ahead and host it. You know, instead of waiting for, you know, someone else that maybe had been here longer, we said, well, let's just host it. So we, that's what we did. I like National Night Out because it's a good it's a good way to, um, to just, you know, have fun with your neighbors and stuff, so. And it's not that complicated, it's just like, oh, come to National Night Out. <laughs> well, we do it because it's such a great time to get everybody together and meet your neighbors and visit and have fun. And we, you know, we want to support our police department, our city, and, and this event up for National Night Out. And just, you know, get out here and have fun and let people, make people aware of what's going on around them and, and have our police over to share in the barbecue. <laughs> they love the neighborhood, they love the city. We've had several homes to sell this um, this past summer and we're meeting some new neighbors, new faces, you know, and they tell us already how much they love Coppell and really glad to be here, love the schools. Just can't say enough good things about this place. I've lived here 25 years and, and I, w I don't regret a minute of it. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi. I love that we get to have come out with friends and, and neighbors and get everybody out and seeing all the kids play in and they always have a lot of fun. It's more sometimes more fun watching all the kids play and, and having fun than um, and everything else. So it's a great time to get the neighbors together. Well, I was new to the neighborhood a few years ago, and National Night Nana gave me an opportunity to meet some of the folks that I'm here with tonight, and I see new people coming in in the neighborhood, and we take that as an opportunity to bring them in and help them understand you know, what Coppell is all about and how much fun we have living here. We absolutely are a fun neighborhood, and we um, really and truly try to get all the ages out here. Um, we're an older couple, and we don't. our children are not in the school system, so we get to meet all these people who have children in the school system and come by and sell us stuff and really just get in our neighborhood and kind of get to know people. And I think this has been great. There have been suggestions for us to have uh, weekly neighborhood get-togethers in people's driveways now. It's been, a, it's been great. We get excited, especially when McGruff shows up and the fire trucks show up. And one, one real special treat tonight was the Junior uh, Police Academy, yes. go, the Explorer Boys, uh -huh. the young men, uh -huh. not boys, yeah. young men. It was really neat um, to kind of ask them some questions and have some of our boys hear that. And that's a neat opportunity for them not only to see uh, some opportunities in the future, but hey, you know, we've got some really cool things to offer here in Coppell, and that's one aspect of the really neat things that we can offer. The greatest part of it is the kids, this is the one thing they look forward to, that they don't get in trouble for playing in the street. That's the one thing they look forward to. Oh, tonight's been an incredible night with uh, communities coming together, uh, neighbors meeting each other. Sometimes some of these neighbors have lived next to each other but don't know each other and here they come out tonight and, and just enjoy the evening. Uh, there's always a host like Jeff here who's been a host for this, this neighborhood and uh, coordinating it is a lot of work but it's certainly worthwhile. It's been a great evening. Well one of the, the great things about tonight is we actually get a chance to thank our great police force and our great fire department for all their service and we don't often get a chance to do that so we certainly had our kids come over and, and thank the department tonight but it's really 
uh, shows the strength of the community in all the facets from our uh, civic departments to the community sense that the residents bring as well. We have a lot of these parties and, and they do it every year, which uh, allows us to interact with folks on a different level. Uh, we have all special units out here, canine, motorcycle officers, the firefighters are out here, our city council is out here, school district personnel are out here, and that's what's special about Coppell, that's what I love about this community. Well, you know, the, just the sense of community that everybody has is, is amazing. You know, you, you go into these neighborhoods and it's just so nice and quiet and the kids are running around, and that's just what Coppell is all about. The, the people I've spoken with, uh, are so genuine and they seem to have a real uh, just a love for their neighbors. One of the things that makes me so proud is that we talk about Coppell as being a family community for a lifetime. This particular event is the exclamation point. It makes um, everybody so excited and it, it's just a proud moment for Coppell in general. We've had a great year this year, National Night Out 2014, the 31st anniversary. We had great food and fellowship with all the new block captains and some of the old ones. They've all met new neighbors, and we had great time with the kids. Well, until next year, you guys be safe.